Hello and welcome to HD Calx. I'm Rick and in this video we're going to have a look at how we can turn on, off, and reset the TI-84 Plus graphing calculator. To do this we'll need to use the second key that looks like this located here, the on-off key that looks like this located back here, and the plus key with the second function of memory that looks like this located here. To start, if we want to turn on our calculator after it's been turned off, we use the ON key. You'll notice if it's off and you press most keys, your calculator won't turn on. So you need to use the ON button down here in the bottom left. Press that. Your screen will activate and you can work with it. When you're done with it, it's a good idea to turn this calculator off because this calculator does take batteries and you don't want it to run out of batteries on you in the middle of a test. To do that, we use the second function key and then the on key again, but since we're using the second function, it's off. There we go, the screen will turn off and we're saving those batteries. Now, if you're getting a weird error with your calculator or you've changed some setting in a way that you're not sure of and it's giving you strange results, it can be a good idea to reset your calculator defaults. To do that, we use the second function key and then the plus key, which brings you to the memory menu here. And all the way down at number seven, you'll see reset. So you can either scroll all the way down and press enter, or just press seven. That'll bring you to this menu here. And again, if you scroll down to two or press two to select defaults, It'll confirm if you want to reset the defaults. We do, so we'll scroll down and press enter. You'll see this screen telling us the calculator has been reset, and if we press clear, we're now good to go ahead and work with it. There we go. All right, I hope this helps, and good luck on those tests out there, everybody.